Okay then, so if we are working then with recording the screen and I've got Bambooza open at the moment, I'm just going to show you a couple of settings on the Moto G for Bambooza on Android. So what we have here straight away is that I'm using the rear camera and I've got resolution at 640. I'm going to dial in the best resolution that I can. I'm going to look at the video quality which is going to be more detail and I can choose if I wish to some audio quality I'm going to leave it at normal um, don't have a Bluetooth but I've got a headset microphone in at the moment store some data title is just Saturday 8 archive for broadcasts I'm not putting in a GPS location at the moment but if I am out and about that's really handy I'm broadcasting in private after that, all I've got to do, and I'm just going to highlight this button here, which is the upload button. And this is that if we get cut off from our Wi-Fi or data connection, then that won't matter at all, or we could even broadcast offline. So to get the thing started, here we are, look. Um, then what I've also noticed on here is that there is a button which at the top and the magnifying glass, if I can click and hold that, it does actually focus it for me. And then to get started, there we go. I'll click in my ear to say that we are here to say that we are broadcasting at the moment. On the screen there, we can get our messages if there are any live. And on the left-hand side, which side, which is the real highlighted thing I want to show you, is the stream health of the connection thing. Because if I choose quite a high and I am moment, if I choose quite a high and I am moment, we can see bottom right here. It does say broadcasting. It does say broadcasting, broadcasting live bit. And then the stream is on the left. Stream is on the left. So the the weaker or the smaller broadcast setting that I choose at the moment. So what I can do there if I now is share it out to the bamboo. What I can do there if I now is share it out to the bamboozer friend, bamboozer friends and any social networks I wish to. I think Facebook is there, but I think I've set up for auto tweeting. So if I come back over there and so I want to stop. Now that bear in mind has gone out live. And what's the interesting part is if my data went What's the interesting part is if my data was a little bit choppy and a little bit awkward, what it allows is literally is to follow this up automatically by the full data stream broadcast device here. So if I click this here, so if I click this and I show you what I mean, is that I've got store complete data, complete data, and we can see that it's actually 5.82. And if I click this and I'll do um, upload all, if I do show progress, it will hide. But if I go back, there you go, look, it's actually doing it without me even saying. So I've transmitted live, and now I'm following that with the perfect broadcast, which as we know, when we watch live, we get a ton of buffering and bits and bobs going on, depending on the data stream. So that's going to finish quite soon. And it's just counting back to say that it's going to finish in, in what, six seconds, four seconds, three, and it has done. And if you are out and about and you're recording multiple streams, then of course, when I go back to the there we go with the little cloud option there there's nothing in there now so that is pretty much it then what I can do is I can go back to my account so if I just go click out once and then I go back to bamboozer which is this one here and then on the right hand side I can see the little then when I go into my then when I go into my of course it is that's why I'm recording it is that's why I'm recording then we can see that there's the broadcast Saturday 8. It's two minutes long. It's actually private at the moment. And here's my, my um, account. If I wish to edit, I can do all of this on mobile. There we go. But what I do want to do is I want to just close that and I want to share it just to one person. And so Saturday 8 wants to be shared. And I want to share that with my bamboozer friends. Notice it's just got Facebook. And I'll go on to Bamboozer, friends, and I'll go through, and you might recognise your own user if you're a friend of mine. Um, and we go down, and I want to share it to Larry. And I'll click that, and you see it's slotted over to red. That is it done, and I will finish this broadcast here and pop it up onto YouTube for everybody.